when I saw this, I was like, I have to have it. When I saw the price, I was like, yeah, no, I'm good. Hi guys, in today's video, I'll be doing a Depop try on haul. I spend way too much time on Depop shopping and selling. Um, and it's a great way to buy like expensive pieces at an affordable price. Um, so I would highly recommend it for everyone. And usually the sellers I buy from, they wear it once and then they post on Depop and then I buy it. Um, so it's not like I'm buying like super used items and then I wear it once and then sell it again just because I have way too much clothes and I shop way too often. So I'll link all the items um, from the original brands down below in the description box. So please make sure to check that out as well. But keep on watching and don't forget to like, subscribe if you like my content. I'll start with um, the black owned businesses. That's usually um, the items I buy secondhand just because um, I mostly shop for pretty little thing. So those are like the most expensive items in my collection, I would say right now. Um, so buying them secondhand, although I'm not supporting the brand, I like putting money in their pockets. I'm still like taking pictures, posting, and doing my part to like make sure other people hear about the brand and stuff like that and eventually once i'm not a struggling college student i'll start to buy more items like from the brand themselves but first um it's this farai london dress you've probably seen this dress it's all over instagram um i bought it in a size extra small so i actually had the orange dress, which I sold on Depop already, but I initially bought the orange dress back in September of 2020. Um, but the problem with the orange one was that when I got it in a size small, the back was just too big. And I think it's because of the material, it's super stretchy. So it just doesn't didn't fit me as form fitting as I would have liked. When I got this, I was super excited um, just because I wanted this more than the orange. Um, because of the color scheme and how the multicolors and how everything just pops. I took this with me to Dubai. It was super pretty, super short. This is not for, this is not really tall girl friendly unless you want everything showing. Like it's really like mini. I didn't really ride up that much. Super great buy. A lot of other sellers are um, selling this on Depop so make sure to get this and you get it at a reduced price. Um, and it's a great item to have in your closet. Next item is from Matt Brand, which is another black owned business. I found them on Instagram and all their items are super cute. It's just like really revealing. Like I can't wear most of their items like outside. Um, so I bought this jumpsuit. It's called the NYCE um, jumpsuit. Um, it's from an older collection. I think it was their 1992 collection actually. The cute thing about this jumpsuit is obviously the print, super cute tie-dye, but it's also has holes literally down the side. You can't really see it, but you'll see it in the try-on portion. I also brought this with me to Dubai, um, but I only wore it to safari just because I, I can't walk outside wearing this. This is like an item you, some people might wear to dinner, but for me, this is like clubby. It just reveals a lot and even have like a low back um strappy super cute not see-through it's double um layered um it's just a super cute piece i'm excited and i'm happy that i was able to get this because i've been looking at it for a while uh, it is stretchy but i would say it's true to size i got the size small the only thing is i'm five seven and it wasn't as long as i thought like i thought this would be like a tall friendly brand but this was, it came down to my ankles and I was, I was hoping that it would like go all the way down to my feet. That way um, it would like look super nice with heels, but that wasn't the case. Um, still super great buy. My next and final black owned business item is this super cute dress from Loud Brand. I think it's called Kenny. It's in this beautiful like tie dye print. 
and it has that texture going all the way down. It's a midi length. Um, it's one shoulder, I'm pretty sure. And it has this like buckle strap um, that you wear. Super cute. Again, I got it at a reduced price because Lao Brand is not cheap. And like Farai London, it's a UK brand, meaning I would have had to pay like a lot to get this shipped to the US. But this is a super pretty dress. It's, she's no longer selling this, which is why I really wanted it in my closet and because blue is my favorite color. Um, it's a midi length, super like classy, beautiful dress. I recently saw on her IG that she's like gonna make more of these, which is great because I haven't seen that many people wear this. I also had the other love brand dress, which is the Vashti dress, I think, in orange. Um, I'll add pictures here. Love that dress. Um, I bought it from Depop as well, but I sold it. I'm super happy to have another Lao Brand dress in my collection. Next item um, is from IMG. I just, as you can tell, I really love color. I love tie-dye. I love anything bright. So when I saw this dress, I really wanted it. But it's being sold for $80. It's like $90 on the website, so I was like, I'm not paying that amount. Um, so I was able to get this dress off Depop for a reduced price. Super cute. I got an extra small because I knew that like I usually size down in my dresses because I want a tighter fit. Um, and I know this will just look great um, on my cleavage area. I'm so excited to wear this. I just received it. Haven't worn it yet, um, but I really cannot wait. And it has like halter detailing and it has orange both at the top and the bottom and it has this like silver hardware that says hi i'm gia super cute and i get why it's expensive like this is thick which i was surprised about it's not see-through i actually love the entire aruna collection from my idea because it's like the most colorful it has the most like browns and oranges so i'm trying to get my hands on the entire thing so i've been on depop waiting to see if other people post more items from it like the bikini set or the like jogger set but i'm really happy to have this and it has like a little knot detail here um no slit thank god but it is a mini dress um super excited the other um img item i bought so the seller had multiple img items that she was selling and i was able to get a bundle for the orange dress i just showed as well as this jumpsuit um it's in a size small or extra small I, the sizing isn't on here but i'm just assuming it's a small um can't really show too much but it is a jumpsuit it is um on the longer side which is great since i am a little bit taller it has this like cage front detail it's from an older collection um it's like more than a year old i'm pretty sure um, but I just thought it was super cute, simple black jumpsuit for like when I'm going out to maybe like a party or dinner and I don't want to do too much, show too much of my legs. Like this will be great for winter time. Um, not that I'm going out anywhere because of COVID, but be already free. And it's just a super cute look. Um, I, I would even wear this during the day because I love black. Um, but yeah, it's not see-through. Super cute, super excited to wear this out. Next item is from Pretty Little Thing. It's this tie-dye dress. You've seen it everywhere. Everyone has this. Um, when I was going to Dubai, I saw so many pictures of people like um, on the rooftops with like a great view with this exact same set on. So I was like, I have to have this. Um, so I was searching on uh, Depop. People had it in different sizes, but I found someone who had it in my size and I negotiated real hard on this set. Um, I might even add clips of the conversation, but just like I'm not paying more than this amount. You can take it or leave it. Um, and thankfully, she let me buy it and it came in time for my trip. Both items are in a US size 4. The corset has boning in it, which is great, sucking in a little bit. Um, the cup is small, which meant that I showed a little bit more quick cleavage, which I was happy about. The skirt is super cute. It has a slit down the side. And the reason why I really love this is because there's like ruching all around the bun. So it made it look like I had an ass. I was shocked. I couldn't believe my eyes. <laughs> it added two inches to my bum. So great buy, definitely recommend. And I might even get other colors because I think I saw a purple one as well. Yes. Next item is probably is the most expensive item in this haul. Um, it's this Luisa Bayou um, swim skirt top 
set I don't even know it's attached um, and it's in this beautiful like blue black green I just love this blue I love this idea I love this aesthetic and I love cutouts like I, I, I live for cutouts so when I saw this I was like I have to have this when I saw the price I was like yeah no I'm good so I was checking I've been checking for months so I was just checking you know on Depop trying to see if I can get it for a lower price but I couldn't really get it for a lower price so I just I did what I needed to do and I bought it I got it in a size extra small because I want this to be like skin tight I haven't worn it yet um, I'm planning to go to Afro Nation um, in 2021 in Portugal so this is one of my outfits like I, I've already planned it out like I'm super excited it's super like revealing but that's the whole point of Afro Nation um, and my goal is to like I want like 40 inch like straight black hair with this on a beach bro I'm super excited um, but this is super cute and after I wear this I'm definitely selling because I cannot justify the price of this and it's like burning a hole in my closet right now but I just remember the affirmation vision I'm like okay I can keep it for another six six months <laughs> the final clothing item is actually the top I'm wearing now it's from Simone and I think it's called Nana Nanu um, super cute ivory uh, just a beautiful top I'll turn around as well and the, the cool thing about it is that you can like design it any way you want like a four-in-one top which I'm excited um, and I just love the cream color and cream against my melanin just screams like rich bitch vibes like sophisticated vibes um so i'm really happy about this and because it's a knit material it's both like winter fall summer spring like you can wear this anywhere so i'm really excited and happy i got this i was just scrolling one time on the top which i usually do and then i was like hmm, let me see if anyone's selling it and then i saw it and i was able to negotiate and get an even cheaper price and the seller was amazing i'm really happy about this it came in like perfect condition she said she had never worn it so this was just a steal but um i definitely love this so the final item for this haul is actually this pearl necklace that I'm wearing right now. I'm closer so you can see that it has like little gold detailing as well. Super cute. Bought it from a seller who originally bought it from the Lux Looks, which is like um, one of those brands where they like take designer like buttons and stuff and make, remake it into jewelry. So when i got the item it initially had this like chanel pendant on it but like which would have been super cute i was so excited to wear this for new year's eve but within like five minutes of me wearing it the pendant popped off um and this is like always the danger when you buy things off of depop that like the seller is lying that they might not be telling you about the actual condition um i talked to the seller and she was like he doesn't know why but it's like I don't know so anyways i have to go and get this fixed um but it's a super cute you know vision idea it's actually my first designer purchase um with the chanel and i wear gold a lot um so it's just super pretty um and it won't cost me too much to get this like reattached to the necklace that was my final item thank you so much for making it this far and watching this video i hope you enjoyed the items i showed and um gain some inspiration from it i'll make sure to link everything in the description down below um yeah thank you for watching and please subscribe and like and comment <laughs> bye